Greetings and welcome to the Astronomy Picture of the Day podcast. Today's picture for October 10th of 2024 is titled Five Bright Comets from Soho. So what do we see here? Well, here we see images from the Soho spacecraft, which is actually observing the sun. So that's its main job. But of course, it also does pick up things that happen to be very close to the sun as well. And here what we're seeing are five comets of the 21st century that have been uh, prominent and actually visible within the SOHO observations. So this is what we call a coronagraph. Now if you note that mask at the center that is blocking out the sun. So if the sun were not blocked out this would be incredibly bright washing out all of the other detail. However, with the uh, instrument like this, we can see then what is called the corona or the very outer atmosphere of the sun. And you can see in some of these images, it's very prominent, uh, including the one to the upper right and the bottom one down below where there is a very prominent, uh, very prominent activity toward the sun, meaning that the sun was relatively active. Although the one to the left on the bottom, bottom left, is also not very active. So we can see that the sun, the corona was very minimally active. Now the sun does go through cycles like that, and in fact has an 11 year cycle of solar activity. So note that it was very active in 2013 and again in 2024. So about 11 years apart. Now it's not perfect and the actual cycles of activity can vary a little bit. Now within each of these you will notice some of the major comets that have been visible in the 21st century including in the upper left Comet McNaught from 2007 which was the brightest comet we have yet had this century. Now we also see several other comets including Lovejoy from 2011, Comet Ison from 2013, Comet Neowise from 2020, and then of course the comet we've been looking at recently and that is Comet Chuchinshan Atlas that is prominent in the lower image. Now right now that comet is actually very close to the sun but slowly moving away and becoming more and more prominent. So in a few more days it may be visible in the evening sky after sunset. And as it gets farther away from the sun it should become more visible. Although the challenge will also be that it will also be getting farther from Earth and farther from the sun, meaning that it should also start to fade in brightness. So it's the question is how far away will it get from the sun before it starts to fade in brightness. Now the blank spot there of course will be for the next comet and it's quite possible we have another one coming this year. Uh, comet S1 Atlas. Will it be another one that will come close to the sun or will it not end up being as such and that we really don't know. As we know comets are very unpredictable because of their nature and because of the fact that we don't see many of these comets regularly. So some comets come back on a regular pattern. Many comets we might see only once. They may come in one time never to return or their periods may be measured in thousands or tens of thousands of years, meaning that we just don't get the time to really be able to see them and study them to get an idea of how bright they will become. So some of these comets uh, were very bright. These comets were some of the more prominent and bright comets that we have seen over the past few decades. So that was our picture of the day for October 10th of 2024. It was titled Five Bright Comets from Soho. We'll be back again tomorrow for the next picture previewed to be Ring of Fire Island. So we'll see what that is about tomorrow. And until then. Have a great day everyone and I will see you in class.